Hello. Welcome to Gareth's Rams. Tonight's the third one on the Caden Heads Club Bottling. They've done three today for their 10th anniversary. And the third one they've done is an interesting one because I don't think I've ever, I've ever tasted a Nord or a Glenord, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's a Highland single malt. It's for Russia. It's part of the 10th anniversary. 2013 Sherry Series. Two or twenty-three, age fifteen years of age, fifty-three point four. So it's quite strong, and it's finished in petrol hemorrhage cast. But that's where we're getting this real dark colour from, as you can see. It's not a great bead when I poured it. Uh, it's very, very dark. It's been in the hem and his cast for a couple of years. So we'll go on there. As I say, I don't know much of it or, or going off, whatever you want to call it. So we'll take the lid off it. It's been poured for a wee while. Bring it up. Very, very dark. What we colour? Let's see what the legs are like. A nice line. When I say line, it's no BD, it's a solid line. And they're not moving as yet. They're not moving at all. I'm now starting to move. Oh, some of them are moving quite quickly. They're starting to be BD now. But when I burned in at first, it was just a solid, solid line. I like that colour. I don't know what we're going to be getting here. Petro Hemino's cast got to be rich. Flavours. Well, let's see what we've got. Bring it to the nose. Oh, very rich. Very rich indeed. Now, this is a sherry bomb. This is definitely a sherry bomb. Dark fruits. Blueberries. Raspberries. That kind of stuff. But rich. Dark fruits, marzipan. When the noise is a very rich, deep noise. There's not much noise prickle, if any, at all. Give it chocolate in there. Cigar smoke, leather. Wood. It's a lovely noise, lovely fruity noise. What we like, I don't know, but it really is. It's a nice, rich noise. 15 years of age, just look at the cover of that. So, let's bring it up to G. What it's like on a pallet. I'll give you sugar. And then bring it back up. Rich marzipan. With a doubt. Christmas cake. I don't know whether I like that or no, because I don't usually. What we know is, but I don't usually like when it's as strong as that. Right, here we go. Hmm.
What is it? It arrives quite slowly. And then it starts to change. The arrival is slow. It's nice, it's pleasant. It's a whiskey for a, a winter's night, I think. As I say, I've never tasted odd before. So I don't know what I'm looking for. Now there's a smell coming there. What is that? Cooks the palate well. Cooks the palate nicely. Quite easy to drink. A lot of flavours in it. A lot of flavours in it. Dark fruit, as I say. There's a smell coming through it, which I don't know what it is. I'll put maybe half a teaspoon for water in it. If you like the colour of whiskey, you like this, it's absolutely, it's a beautiful colour. I really don't have much to say about it, to be honest. It's a nice sherry whiskey, it's very powerful. There's no doubt about that. Yeah, It's nicer with water. It's a lot nicer with water. It's actually quite pleasant with water. I wonder if I could put a wee bit just to see what I've got. And that's a fair bit of water in it. Not quite a tablespoon, but quite a fair bit. Mm. Water makes it more flavour, brings out a lot of flavours in it, it's nice. So, Highland Single Malt Scotch, 15 year old. The one that sticks out for me is the Kalila, there's no doubt about it. Um, not a great sherry fan to be honest, but they're, they're okay. Um, People will open them, people will keep them. So, thanks for watching Gab's Drums. Nothing to excite me on these three, to be honest. Uh, nothing got me jumping at my seat, but they're drinkable. If you like sherry whiskey, you'll like that. If you're a bourbon man like myself, it's drinkable, but nothing to shout home about. Anyway, thanks for watching Gary's Drums. Press the bell, press the subs button. Buy me a coffee if you wish, and hope to see you all next week. Thanks for watching Gary's Drums.